Hi, Dispensinator here, and I'm making a recording about my weight loss journey that I'm about to begin. Today is actually the first day. Um, I weigh 285 pounds, 0.5 pounds. <laughs> I thought I was closer to 286, but that's what they weighed me in at. I'm doing a weight loss competition at my gym. I actually did it last year and lost 53 pounds. I think I started at 267 in around 215-ish range. And um, it was great because I lost a lot of weight. Start building some good muscle, but uh, I got sick. I got H. pylori, and uh, don't know the, what that is. It's a bacteria that pretty much eats away your stomach lining. So I got really sick from that. Actually, had it happen, it hit me pretty bad about the end of the competition, which was nice because it killed my appetite, but also made me really sick. And I just got sicker and sicker. And finally, um, th you know, through antibiotic and stuff, I've come back testing negative for it lately. And then I had a scope done, and I came back. They did a biopsy and. The dose test came back negative, so I, I'm over it now, but it can take between six months and a year to completely heal, and I'm still in a lot of pain right now. And because of that, I've been sleeping a lot. The antibiotics are just horrible. They make you even sicker, in my opinion. At least it made me sicker. So I've been sleeping a lot. I haven't been eating healthy. I haven't been going to the gym. I have, like, no motivation. So I ended up gaining a lot of the weight back and some, you know. Um, I do feel like I'm still, like... Athletically, I'm better shape than I was last year, even though I weigh more now, just because I've still been making myself go play basketball once or twice a week. <laughs> it's the only thing I can push that, that I can go do and push through the pain of the stomach issues I've had. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna try and push through the pain this time and just continue just to work out. I actually started a couple weeks ago working out again, and it actually I found out that going to the gym helps with the pain, the endorphins I get from it. So, um, yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. It's going to be three months from now to the end of the competition. So we'll see how I do, see if I can lose weight. I would like to win again. I actually won last year for the men's division, and I got a little trip, and I actually, <laughs> I actually cashed in the trip to, instead to do the competition again. So, yeah, we'll see how I do. And, I'll, I'll, you know, and uh, I'll show you a little bit what I look like now. Um, do a little bit with my shirt on. For those people that don't want to see the meme with my shirt off, here's just what I look like. Yep, that's about it. And if you don't want to see me with my shirt off, go ahead and click pause or stop now and leave. So I'm going to show you what I look like without, and we'll see what the transition is from now to three months from, you know, three months from now. <laughs> here we go. Blah. I still have some good muscle tone in my shoulders, I'm happy about. I mean, I haven't been to the gym in months, but I'm still, you know, I still see some of the gains I have that I made in my shoulders and stuff. A lot of this stuff is covered up with fat now. I used to be able to see my abs. <laughs> That's kind of sad. Now this is all back. I never was able to get rid of this because what am I going to do? It's just skin, a lot of it, you know, and now it's filled with fat, but you get the idea. Ooh, hairy back, gross. So, yeah, let's see. We'll see what happens. And that is it. I'm going to put my shirt back on. Actually, I'm going to stop. But thank you for watching.